welcome i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um this is the energy vibration lesson for the business areas people um my excuses for the lateness it's beyond my control all right aries what we see is that a lot of you young people were hoping for something it's not going to be happening there is not going to be a new story that is coming in a lot of problems for you young aries between the ages of uh 25 and 45 a lot of you young aries are having some serious serious issues and some serious problem um work uh foundation stability is not looking well as we look at your foundation uh the energy of the four of uh the four of wands uh, is standing here in the reverse so a whole lot of problems at the workplace so that is going to be coming up for um you aries uh, some sort of a problem some sort of an issue at the workplace you're dealing with um um uh, bosses company corporations and a whole lot of problems especially for you business people business areas people um your business is going to be shutting down so business areas people um there's uh, huge problems with your business so there it is we see some sort of a contract um that a lot of you were hoping for um to bring in it's not going to be happening for you aries whatever that was happening and transpiring the energy of the lovers is uh, this new contract uh, that a lot of you aries was trying to get for a cancer and a gemini is not going to be happening so a lot of you were hoping for some sort of a new contract for a cancer and a gemini it's not going to be happening we see um um, the energy of the nine of cups and the nine of cups is always a very promising energy is Jupiter in Pisces. So, so um, I see that a Pisces is going to be having uh, a lot of um, happiness and joy over a uh, cancer. A, a, a Pisces is going to get a contract, but a um, cancer and a Gemini is not because whatever is transpiring, the energy of this contract will be going to a Pisces and it's not going to be going to a Gemini and a Cancer. So I see um, no new start is coming up for a Gemini and a Cancer. I see they have recognized that a Gemini and a Cancer could have created a whole lot of problems. And uh, um, because of this, I see no contract. A Gemini and a Cancer is not going to be getting a contract. So um, communication is going to a Gemini and a Cancer and they're going to be recognized and there is not going to be a new start for them because of uh, some instability, something that has created and something that has transpired. This new contract that a lot of you Aries was open for is not going to be happening for you, especially they're going to be coming down on a gemini and a cancer and because of uh, coming down on this gemini and this cancer you aries are not going to be successful pisces are going to be successful and whoever that was working against a pisces this person is going to be successful and they are going to be this pisces is going to be receiving a new contract but you aries are not going to be receiving a new contract all right so we see some sort of a news is coming in um, for you Aries. The ace of uh, um, this is the cliver of the one. So news is coming in for you Aries that a whole lot of problems at the workplace. So, and I see no happiness at the workplace. A lot of you business Aries, your business is going to be um, censored out because they recognize some sort of a problem with your business. So um, I see... Um, that there is going to be some sort of a problem that is coming up for a whole lot of you Aries and especially for young Aries, you young Aries in the first week has gotten some sort of a news um, that is not happy and it's about a contract that is not going to be extended. 
So a lot of you could have had it or is going to be hearing at the end of the month. I see a lot of you leaving, looking for um, new jobs, new opportunities somewhere else because this contract is not going to be renewed. So young Aries, and these are people between the ages of 25 and 45 that is seriously having some sort of an issue. Communication is coming at you that... Um, a lot of you Aries, especially young Aries, was not expecting. A lot of you young Aries had hope uh, um, that there was going to be some sort of a changes and that your contract would have extended. But um, at the first week, a lot of you um, young Aries, and these are people between the ages of 25 and 45, it's going to be recognizing it's not going to be happening. There is no long-term stability in a corporation institution for you anymore. And the energy of Venus in Aries is saying to you, young Aries, um, you need to start looking for a new job because there is no um, stability for you in a company anymore. A Pisces is going to be taking over your position. So whoever you Aries is and was, is as if your work is uh, um, not up to standard and a Pisces is coming in and a Pisces is going to be reorganized reorganizing 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 um the corporation institution and that is the reason why you Aries do not have a position moving forward in a, a corporation institution. There we see um a lot of you businessmen were hoping for some sort of a new contract, some sort of a new business deal to come through. That is also going to be falling through. Um, who is going to be getting this business deal is basically um, the Pisces. Okay. So if you notice this nine of cups, uh, oh, nine of pentacles, my excuses. Um, nine of pentacles is about Venus in a Virgo. This nine of pentacles is about Venus in Virgo. And this is good. Um, this is about um, um, money is going to be uh, um, coming, um, uh, releasing. And a whole lot of you businessmen, I hope to receive some money. But a bank financial institution is not going to be offering you this financial support for your business. So Aries businessmen, you got to be aware of this. Um, a lot of you at, was open, could have applied for some sort of a financial help from a bank financial institution. Um, but you Aries, it is not going to be happening for you Aries. The people that could receive this offer, um, is a Pisces or a, um, Cancer or a Virgo. A Pisces, a Cancer and a Virgo. But for especially the Pisces, they're going to be receiving this. Now, the Virgos, this um, Venus in Virgos, the Virgos will um, and is open also for some sort of a new start. So it could have been that some of you Aries businessmen were uh, connecting with a Virgo and was open um, that some sort of a situation between you and a Virgo would have transpired, but it's not going to be transpiring. It's not going to be happening. And they're going to be, and you're going to be recognizing this. And it's going to be a situation where some sort of unhappiness is going to be happening and transpiring um, for you, um, Aries. But it is what it is. It is a situation where a lot of you, Aries, are dealing with some sort of a karmatic issue. And especially young Aries, you can see this. As we get to the third week, a lot of you young Aries is going to be recognizing, um, you know, my time is here. And my time is up. I, you know, I, there is no new stability that is going to be coming in for me. My time is up. This contract that I was hoping to receive is not going to be happening because my time is up. So however this was happening and this was transpiring, a lot of people are now going to be recognizing and recognizing what was um, happening and how a corporation um, institution is doing some reorganization and a lot of you areas are going to be left out of this organization and people are going to be recognizing the, the transition that is coming up and the transition that has been affecting a lot of you. At the end of the month, um, the fourth week, I see a lot of you looking for new avenues, okay? A lot of you are looking for some sort of a new avenue. An Aquarian um, is going to be released um, out of some sort of a contract 
whoever this Aquarian is, a lot of you are getting um the the, the situation um uh, getting the information um saying that uh, um you are being released out of a contract. So however this is happening and transpiring, I see no no happy ending is coming up for some of you. For the rest of you, it is a situation where some sort of information is going to be coming in in the first week that is going to be affecting you and a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a payout from a corporation institution and um some of you are going to be using this payout to begin your new um business and this is going to be and a lot of you are very worried because a lot of you were not expecting this but it is what it is ladies and gentlemen and we can't fight against the flow of what is going on. We just can't fight against the flow of what is going on. We have to be recognizing and understanding what is transpiring and what is happening. So I see um, a whole lot of the, uh, you are going to be recognizing maybe it is time that I move on um, from an institution corporation because it's not working um, for me and what I expected is not what I'm getting out of it. So, so um reorganization is coming up it's kind of um very this reorganization that is coming up is kind of weird um because this reorganization is coming up at a time that a lot of you aquarians were um aries was not ready for this new start and a lot of you feel as if uh, you have not been um properly um uh you know, treated well because all of a sudden you're recognizing um, that changes is coming up and you are part of these changes. So I see it's about um, um, uh, people um, uh, recognizing that, you know, it's time for them to move on. I see a lot of you areas are going to be thinking, I'm not feeling um, and I'm unsure of uh, um, a new contract okay a lot of you Aries and I see a lot of you Aries at the end of the month there it is is that you are moving forward and looking at uh, new avenues because you recognize that this corporation it is now over so a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a news uh, um, that a, a contract that you were expecting is not going to be coming in um, so this is going to be something that is going to be coming up and whatever is happening here, a lot of you, uh, Aries, have to recognize that sometimes it is best to look for better avenues. And sometimes you can feel that it is time for you to move in a new direction. So however this was coming up and transpiring, um, this is going to be affecting especially business men and women, people who have their business. They're, you're going to be recognizing that you know, some major changes is happening. And, you know, before you could have received help, but it's as if now the help that you were open for is not going to be coming in. So a lot of you businessmen also have to pay back a whole lot of money. And this is the reason why um, some sort of a new contract that some of you businessmen wanted is not going to be coming in because they're going to be saying, look, um, it is a, a situation where you have to um, re- um evaluate they're re re-evaluating some of your um businessmen situation and it's recognizing um that um it is best for a lot of you businessmen uh choose for another direction and move into another direction so it is a situation where um businessmen and women are going to be recognizing that uh, um, you know, the, the stone that you were looking for in your corporation institution is not going to be there. Whatever that was happening, whatever that was transpiring, the stone that you were looking for is uh, um, not going to be available to you. And you're going to be now recognizing that it is about time that you um, see um, for yourself that, uh, you know, it, it, it is time to move on because uh, Whatever that you were hoping for or whatever that you had planned to uh, expand your business is not going to transpire. It is uh, affecting people between the ages of uh, 45 and older. You're going to be okay at the work floor. Um, but people 25, between the ages of 25 
or let's say 2045, you're going to be um, not receiving a new contract and you're going to be recognizing, um, yes, it is time for you to move on. I do love you guys. Um, if you want to see the extended, I'm moving on to this extended. If you want to see the extended, um, you can choose um, to use um, the link below to get to the join button or use a join button to get there. It is um, the second abundant where you can pick up uh, these readings. I do love you guys. Please show your love by thumbs up. I love you. Namaste.